Hey, welcome back guys. This is Eugene from Sportmotive. I'm a car dealer and a car enthusiast like you. We do a lot of test drives, reviews, uh, different sports cars we come across. I go to the auction. I bought, drove and sold thousands of cars. So we'll show you some insights of being a car dealer. And today here we got a 2021 Kia Stinner. I'm not the, the biggest fan on the body style on these, but I know there's a big following. People like these. But uh, this one's GT, all-wheel drive. Cool wheels, Brembo brakes. Interesting color. I love the Mustang orange, but this one, I don't know, just doesn't pop to me like the Mustang does. Big brakes, Pilot Sports, Michelin. Size, let's find the size on it, huh? Okay, we got 225, 40, 19 in the front. Let's check the back. Oh, and this has got like the black panoramic roof, if you call it. Let's see the back size, uh, 255, 35, 19. A little wider in the back. But I'm gonna do this video, walk around, show you inside and out. Thank you for a test drive. If you're in the market for one of these, get you an opinion, see if that's what you like or not. Cool. Okay guys, this is the inside, 2021 Stinner Kia. Not bad, but not as fancy, of course, as uh, those BMWs or new Mercedes. Still kind of cool, but I think this, the whole vent setup they have, I think big rip off of the Mercedes now they got, the, the, like the new Mercedes, they, that's the look exact look they have. Shifter over here, park. Couple options, heated seats, AC seats, cup holders, tray, uh, console, heated steering wheel. I think, I think this is the backup view or something, we'll see. What else we got? Aux, USB plug-in, basic kind of features, nothing too fancy. Cruise control, GT logo on the bottom, paddle shifters. I think I've seen higher trims than this. This doesn't look as fancy as I think they come sunroof of course I think I see nicer nicer interiors like stitches different color more exotic looking more exquisite if you will so I got the uh, brake on let's start this thing still a Kia let's uh, pop it into drive and go take a first spin let's see if they got any oh, drive modes Let's see, okay, we got sport, custom. Oh, I did custom and I feel my uh, seat getting squishy. Uh, squishy my, like where my ribs are on the back. The side bolsters. So let's go try it. See what she's got. Heads up display over there as well. If you can see, let me zoom it in a little bit. It's orange, I think you can change colors probably. Cool. Let's go. So it's a six cylinder uh, all wheel drive. Yeah, she's not slow, she goes. Not bad. This one's only got 5,000 miles. I gotta do some research, see if these come more like different trims, like a more sporty trim or racing trim or I, th I thought this was supposed to be a five killer. So when this came out, that's what I was kept hearing. So, but maybe not this one. This one seems kind of basic. If you know uh, what, what I'm talking about, and there's more trims or different levels, let me know in the comments. Educate me a little bit. Camera comes on. I love the the lighting on that thing. Kind of purple. I'm guessing you can change all that stuff. But let's uh, punch the pedal to the floor. I guess she accelerates, but yeah, almost 80. Just don't feel like nothing, like too much luxury. Don't feel no luxury in this thing. It feels kind of basic, but I guess it's a Kia. What do you expect? It's my first time driving one of these uh, Stinners, so I'm not sure what to compare it to or what to look for. Nothing special. I never really liked much uh, the design on these, the looks on the outside. 
but I know there's a lot of people who love these the way they look but uh, not not one of those and this one's got the orange color if you can see on the hood uh, this one doesn't look as good in this color I love the Mustangs the 2015 plus Mustangs with the same orange color those look sick but I don't know this one just doesn't pop to me We got memory seats, lock on lock, power mirrors, windows. I think like lane assist, blind spot warning, trunk, fuel tank. Rice. Let's accelerate. Normally nothing crazy. got this weird smell in here like some plastic chemical smell like when you burn the plastic it smells bad in here I don't know if that's that's how it's supposed to or there's something going on but it's got this fake uh, plastic chemical smell if you know what I'm saying like when you get those uh, water bottles uh, the what you call them there's the PBA free I think and then the ones that are not PBA free they're the ones that the chemical leaches out into your bottle, into your water. This is the smell that I'm smelling right here. Put on park. Then they jump out and then wait, I'm in reverse. So park over here. Okay, good. And the uh, parking brake. Mm, oh yeah, so you pull it up and it engages. I'll jump out and pop the hood, the trunk, look around, back seat. So we got the trunk. Okay, you gotta hold it a little bit, it goes up. Trunk space, cool floor mats, spare somewhere deep in there. Auto trunk over here. Cool. Let's pop this lid over here, the, tr the hood. So we got turbo, GDI, it's a Kia thing. Looks kind of cool, I guess. Not sure if this is original or aftermarket. Kind of cool, clean. Of course, we got the LED headlights, look pretty cool. Hey guys, thanks for watching, I appreciate it. Uh, if you found this useful or like the video, don't forget to hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, subscribe, like. We got a new video pop every day of the week. Sports cars, test drives, that kind of stuff, reviews, so stay tuned and uh, we'll see you next time.